we've got different values. We work, we, what we do is we, we understand that the student population at universities are a very good resource. It's also a low cost resource. So uh, we give, we work with universities and we bring on students. And then we basically offer them an opportunity if, that's if the students don't come with the ideas. If the ideas come from a different part, then they can come on board as kind of like technology partners. Make them like a little CTO or something. So it means that by the end of, in the time they're done after a year or two, while they were studying, they were doing kind of coding on the spare time, their coding skill improves, they can put on a CV that they've worked for a little startup, we give them a letter of recommendation. If it, go, if it does work very well, they actually have a business by the time they graduate. And a business that can that has got a global market. So we kind of like present that as a compared to working for a big company doing the same work. So so we, we have that kind of process that we have we can come and support that. How do you protect uh, intellectual property? We don't protect intellectual property. We don't care about intellectual property. Oops. Yeah. No. No, no, the reason for that is we, we realize that if someone wants to steal your idea, they're going to steal it in. Right? It's, however, what we try and do is we try, we, we try and be the first to market. If it is something that, is, that needs to be patented, that's got some, then it's fine. If you're building a, a mobile application or a a website that's got some nice features, the likelihood would be that that feature probably exists somewhere in the world, in a different context. Um, so we don't, we, we talk about, we do, we do kind of the copyright and the rules stuff, but we don't spend huge lawyer fees on um, protecting, and therefore having everybody sign NDAs and stuff. You know, it comes to conflict. What we do is we, we, we basically want to Get what we have the idea out to market as quickly as possible to see if it's viable. If there is traction, then we just kind of continue building and working on it. So, the relationship between uh, somebody who's a former drug addict who comes out with a brilliant idea and a, the programmers, the actual kids who are coming in and working on the project, is just a social contract? No. Oh, you no, know, in that sense, what yeah. we do is once they start working together, the person who does the development gets equity, as well as all that with equity in the idea. So we incubate it, we give it, we nurture it. It's one thing to build the product, it's different if you haven't got networks to leverage it. So what our level is in there would be, for example, if you want to, let's say you want to develop something for mobile, mobile application, we can say, okay, using our networks, we can basically then open up doors with operators, doors to certain kind of companies that might benefit you. If you're doing something, let's say for Twitter, we can say, listen, we can connect you with the founders of Twitter and connect you with the right people there so that you can do things. If you're looking for something on Facebook, we've got people at Facebook that you can connect to. With. So it's, it's more than just because the value lies in the execution of taking it from product to market. So what we tell them is, listen, the person doing the development will give you 5%. 10% equity, shares, ownership in this idea. If it works, you've got 10%. If it doesn't work, you've got experience. Right? But, the, but because we operate and we only incubate social enterprises, even if it doesn't just work as a social enterprise, at least that project will change someone's life. So there's always, that is the, the first value. And that is why, for example, if you're doing something in farming uh, and you now give your personal information, even if it bombs up afterwards, but if you've helped one farmer, I don't know how they can use their mobile phone to, to manage whatever, but help a farmer, that, that is good enough. You know, for us, it's whatever the investment is in one life, we will put over it. And of course, if it works as an enterprise, then they will all need to be. 